the tax driver was like, whoa, what a nice car. Did the spin out. Bruce? The GCPD's been compromised. The children of Arkham were listening the whole time. How? That's what I'm going to find out. Alfred, I'm sending over evidence of some kind of encrypted communication signal. It's coming up on my screen now, but I'm afraid it looks like a bunch of gibberish to me. I need to go to Wayne Tower and look into this. Get me Lucius on the line. Yes, right away. If the public finds out the police aren't able to communicate... <sighs> It'll cause a panic. Just what the children of Arkham want. Mass chaos. That seems to be how the Penguin does business. I have Lucius on the line now. Bruce, are you there? I'm looking at this data Alfred sent me. It's messy. I have to know what the children of Arkham are doing. How fast can you decrypt? That's a tough one, but I should have it cracked soon if you can meet me at Wayne Tower. Already on my way. <sighs> How did it become so bright all of a sudden? It was pitch black like two seconds ago. Why do you gotta look at me like that? It's not like I did all these things. It was my father. Almost there, Lucius. I'll meet you down in the lab. Some aspects of the children of Arkham surveillance are worrying. It's just funny. Great. You know, like they're all looking at me like I'm a sleaze ball, but yet they're still working for me, sure, woman. accepting I my money. Think you'd be here. I was. Uh, I used to look to Thomas for guidance in hard times. Must seem silly. After everything that's happened. You know what they say about old habits. To what do I owe the pleasure, Regina? I'm sorry, I just needed to clear my head. Sort things out. In my office? I know it's irregular, but it's nice to have a reminder of the Waynes every once in a while, in all their glory. I've been called in for an emergency board meeting. I wasn't told about it. You weren't invited, Bruce. You are the topic of discussion for the board. They want to decide what your future at this company will be. Whether to dismiss you or not. You have to understand, Bruce. This company is bigger than any one individual. We have to keep face. And after this scandal... What my father... I'm not him, Regina. I would never compromise the lives of innocents for my own benefit. I know that, Bruce. But you have to understand that what the public wants to hear isn't always what we want to hear. The whole city is watching to see what our next move is going to be. Bruce, I've got something. You need to get down here. Now! I worked with your parents for years, and neither of them gave any indication of foul play. How could you have ever known? Bruce. You're nothing like him. Right, girl, I gotta leave. Stop talking my ear off. We always build up the people closest to us. When they fall... I appreciate the sentiment, Regina. Thank you. I mean what I said before. Families like ours need to flock together. Perhaps now more than ever. I should head down. Yeah, thank you. Get out. To make a decision without me. I need to do Batman things. I'll come find you after. <laughs> I'll be right down, Lucius. They got like a bat pole I get to slide down? Because that'd be awesome. That'd be a nice little call back to the old Batman series. Unlock secret entrance. All right, it's the only thing I can do. Once again, doesn't need to be a little interactive game to do that. Easily just be a cutscene. <laughs> Press the button on the desk. It's a real weird way to unlock something. Oh, no fire pole. That's upsetting. Retina scanner? Damn, son. Some high tech shit. Alright, Lucius. How does he get down here? Does he have to come through my office or does he have his own little entrance? It's good, good question. He's still in your corner. <laughs> Spying on my conversations again? Hey, I'm looking out for you. There have been whispers that the board was going to take action against you. If you lose the company, Batman will take a massive hit too. I know the cave is well equipped, 
But all of this is owned and paid for by the company. The board's in a panic, but this'll die down before it comes to that. I'm glad you're being optimistic about this, but I'm not so sure. Right now, finding out how the children of Arkham are spying on the police is more important. What have you got? It's Wayne Tech, Bruce. As you know, Wayne Enterprises is a telecommunications giant. If someone were to, say, uh, build a back door into that tech... You're telling me the children of Arkham hacked into this system? So that's the thing. Do you want the good news or the bad news? Uh, you're not gonna like it. Just it's get on with it, Lucius. We don't have time for games. Forgive me for trying to lighten the mood. The back door they're using. I was the one who built it. You? What are you talking about? He's a traitor. Kill him. As Batman started, you needed a way to move <laughs> the city. Well, this is how. I piggyback Batman's surveillance onto Wayne Enterprise's signal. If the children of Arkham have access to the same system, does that mean they know my identity? It looks like they've only accessed the GCPD so far. Not a lot of activity otherwise. I'll have Alfred warn Gordon. The GCPD needs to get rid of their Wayne Tech devices. Smart move. <laughs> I just love the texting in this game. It kills me. <laughs> tap, 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 tap. Right away, sir. It's just so stupid. I've encrypted our access. I can fortify it, but it's going to take longer to force them out of the system. The question remains, how did the children of Arkham find out about the back door in the first place? They shouldn't have been able to find it. Not <laughs> sure you should, you should tell them. <laughs> Whoever broke in certainly knew how to cover their tracks. We have a mole. There's no way they could have gained access without someone on the inside. Only a handful of people at the highest level could possibly find out about the back door. I'm going to keep working on this Children of Arkham business. See if there's a way to shut down their access entirely. We'd better lock this stuff down, just in case. Alright, let's see what we can do here, guys. Could watch the news? Why would I want to do that? And get over here? No? Nothing? Hope for like a little Easter egg or something? Nothing? That's upsetting. Let's check it out. This battering. I would love to have a battering. That'd be cool. But I'd probably end up throwing at somebody and hurting them really bad. So, well, I think I don't have one. Um, check out the whiteboard, I guess. Looks like another invaluable piece of Lucius Fox technology. Look at this photograph. And he's really taking after you. And Luke, stubborn as always. I think of what Gotham has become. And I think of them. They give me all the reason I need to work with Batman. He's the only one that will truly protect them. And he will, Lucius. Always. Always and forever. Okay, why did it kick me out if I just have to re talk to Lucius again? What is this? Just the table, okay. That's weird. I always wonder why you had a table that could hide itself. I guess it's coming in pretty handy now. Trust me. It was much more paranoia than precaution. Okay, I guess I'm just gonna, you know, talk to Lucius and see what he wants me to do here. So, anything new? This is gonna take some time. Don't worry. I'll let you know when I find it. <laughs> this is literally just a waiting game. I just gotta wait for time to pass. I guess I'll look at everything then on this table. That's probably what you have to do. Ooh, what's this? Uh, something I'm still working on. Some new armament to assist you in the field. There's only so much you can do on your own. But it's not really ready yet. This is working on the hob, uh, Hobgoblin glider, man. It becomes some Batman villain. Thermal vision. <laughs> You've been busy, haven't you, Lucius? So I really hope all these goodies come into play eventually. The first one back from Selina. <laughs> Wonder if that's the only thing she stole. She hasn't stole any of my semen yet, which is upsetting, but <laughs> besides that. 
All right, I'll check the sticky, sticky bomb. bomb I developed. The signal is activated on the underside. Attach it wherever you need, then detonate it remotely with your gauntlet. Boom. Nice. Be careful. Those things pack a serious punch. All right, I got a new sticky bomb. Let's. Uh, I guess we'll watch the news then. Why not? Elected Mayor Harvey Dent gave a rousing speech late last night, refuting claims that the children of Arkham were gaining control in Gotham. Despite his run-in with the masked group on the way to the event, people are still hopeful that Mayor Dent can pull through on his campaign promises. Who are the children of Arkham really fighting for? Who is Batman really protecting? Because it's not us. It's time that we, not masked vigilantes and violent fringe groups, fought for ourselves. I will fight every day for Gotham. And I ask that you join me. We are proud citizens of Gotham. And this is our city. Next up, we speak to Commissioner Grogan regarding increased security measures citywide. Commissioner Grogan? <laughs> okay. I guess Gordon's not the commissioner in this game. I already looked at the table. Why is it making me look at the table again? Alright, put it back in. And now can we talk? Are you done yet? <sighs> Looks like Regina's headed to my office. I should go. Now before you do... Here. Get that back to the bat computer. It'll install the, the computer. measures. You'll also have all the info I found on the children of Arkham's activity within the system. Thanks, Lucius. I've always got your back, Batman. Now get out of here. Regina doesn't like to be kept waiting. Alrighty then. She's gonna magically pop up into my office. She'd be like, where'd you come from? Chest pieces back to where they were. Oh, goodness. It's away. Seems like a very like weird Open up. setup for a secret door. I thought maybe you left. Yeah, right. Well. The board has voted. And have they sent the chairwoman to wield the axe? You're being asked to step down from your position as CEO. Effective immediately. At least until this whole mess gets cleaned up. We were out of options, I'm afraid. Hmm. Are you hearing me, Bruce? You're no, no. longer the CEO of Wayne Enterprises. Absolutely, just I asked absolutely to not. Slow all this down, but. The press release is going out as we speak. There will be a public event in the morning where you will formally announce your resignation. I'm sorry, Bruce. I tried to fight for you. The board believes this is the only logical course of action. I see where they're coming from. <sighs> Sometimes silence is the best Our option. stock is tanking. The board is losing confidence. Wayne Enterprises needs a new face. They already had a candidate in mind. I thought it was... <clears throat> I was outvoted. Remember, he'd only be interim CEO. Just until this mess gets cleared up. Well, who is and it? who would that be? Oswald Calipot? Let me guess. Sure enough. Oswald Cobblepot. Bruce, old boy. Good to see you again. Yeah, whatever. I'll hug his bitch ass. As you know, Oswald's parents were, well, victims of your father's actions. This company was built on the land he stole from the Cobblepot family. Well, the board thought having me step in would be a good PR move. What better way to show Gotham that Wayne Enterprises is committed to righting the wrongs of the past? Happy to help any way I can. Like giving it to a guy who's had multiple arrests and shit? That makes a lot of sense. And considering that your parents stole from mine, 
I hear you've been keeping yourself pretty busy, Oswald. You sure you can handle this? I mean, wasn't there a revolution that you had to handle? I'm a brilliant multitasker. The board has complete confidence in Mr. Cobblepot. As his resume goes into great detail, his endeavors in England have been quite successful. Besides, the company basically runs itself at this point. The CEO is mostly a figurehead. Don't make this harder than it has to be. You might want to check your facts, Regina. That resume sounds a little too good to be true. You might want to have more confidence in your own board. His resume checks out, and his references were all glowing. You're quite welcome to call them yourself. That won't be necessary. I'm afraid we need you to leave the building immediately. We'll have your personal effects sent to you. He's the traitor. Guarantee it. That bitch. Congratulations, Bruce. I couldn't be prouder of you. Alfred. Oh, how sweet. Graduation present. Surely we could let him take this along. Wow, way to be a dick. Clumsy, clumsy. No wonder you're not being trusted with nice things anymore. I'll call someone in to clean that up. It'll only take a minute. Oh, Bruce and I can handle it. No trouble. Pick it up. Now. No, no, it's all right. Bruce has been through enough today, hasn't he? Mm. Looks broken, I'm afraid. Not a good sign, is it? Time to go, Bruce. Yes, Bruce. Time to go. I have a little redecorating to do. Your taste is a little too discreet for me. I think that maybe I'll add a fish tank. You're not getting away with this. I'll make sure of it. Oh? Oh, is that a threat? I'm terrified. I don't need to threaten you. This way, Bruce. What a little shithead. <laughs> Making a so-called company more corrupt makes Fantastic. sense. Yeah, I know, right? Thank you so much, Regina. Not the smartest people. <laughs>